Welcome back to Animal Facts. Here we give you nothing but absolute facts so believe it. In this video, we're diving into the incredible realm of insects, where size knows no bounds. Get ready to be amazed as we introduce you to the top 10 largest bugs that roam our planet, from the rainforests to the deserts and beyond. Each insect on our list is a testament to nature's ability to create creatures of astounding dimensions. We'll delve into their habitats, behaviors, and unique adaptations that allow them to thrive in diverse environments. Many thanks to all our subscribers, without your support we wouldn't have been here. We appreciate the support and for those new to the channel we welcome you. Please don't forget to leave a like and hit that subscribe button. Now then, it's time to get the countdown rolling. Kicking off today's list we have Tarantula Hawk Wasp. The Tarantula Hawk Wasp is a large and impressive insect known for its unique behavior and appearance. Tarantula Hawk Wasps are among the largest wasps in the world. They have a robust and muscular body, with a striking coloration that often includes vibrant shades of black and orange. Their body shape is elongated and somewhat flattened. The body of the Tarantula Hawk Wasp is usually black with bright orange or reddish-orange wings. This coloration is thought to serve as a warning to potential predators, indicating that the wasp is armed with a powerful sting. The most distinctive behavior of the tarantula hawk wasp is its method of reproduction. The female wasp hunts down tarantulas, stings them to paralyze them, and then lays an egg on the tarantula's body. When the egg hatches, the larva feeds on the immobilized spider, eventually leading to the spider's death. The length of a tarantula hawk wasp can vary depending on the species and region. On average, they measure around 1 to 2 inches to 5 centimeters, in length. The wingspan can also be considerable due to the wasp's size and relatively broad wings. It's important to note that while tarantula hawk wasps have a fearsome reputation due to their hunting behavior, they are generally not aggressive towards humans unless provoked. Taking ninth place we have Queen Alexandra's Birdwing. Queen Alexandra's Birdwing butterfly, Ornithoptera alexandrae, is one of the largest and most magnificent butterfly species in the world. Queen Alexandra's Birdwing has an impressive wingspan that can reach up to 1 foot 30 centimeters or more, making it one of the largest butterflies on Earth. The wingspan of females is generally larger than that of males. This butterfly displays a stunning combination of colors. The upper side of its wings is predominantly black with iridescent greenish blue and white markings. The undersides of the wings are more muted, featuring a mix of browns and grays. Male and female Queen Alexandra's birdwing butterflies have distinct differences in appearance. Males usually have narrower wings with brighter and more vibrant colors, while females have broader wings and more subdued coloration. The body of the butterfly is relatively small compared to its wings. It has a black body with a fuzzy texture, and the abdomen is segmented and slender. Queen Alexandra's birdwing butterflies are native to Papua New Guinea, where they inhabit tropical rainforests. They are often found in the lowland forests and river valleys of their range. Taking the 8th spot we have giant water bugs. Giant water bugs, also known as toe biters or electric light bugs, are aquatic insects belonging to the family Bellostomatidae. Giant water bugs have a flat, oval-shaped body with a broad and flattened appearance. Their body shape is well-suited for life in aquatic environments. These insects often have a dark brown or black coloration, which helps them blend into their underwater surroundings. Some species may have patterns or markings that provide camouflage. Giant water bugs have strong and robust legs, which they use for swimming as well as for capturing and handling prey. Their front legs are adapted into large, strong pincers used for grasping and subduing prey. Unlike other aquatic insects, giant water bugs do not have gills. Instead, they have a unique adaptation called a scuba tank. They trap a bubble of air against their abdomen, which they use for breathing while submerged. This allows them to stay underwater for extended periods. The length of giant water bugs can vary based on species and location. On average, Giant water bugs are typically around 1 to 4 inches, 2.5 to 10 centimeters, in length. Some larger species can reach lengths of up to 5 inches, 12.7 centimeters, or more. It's important to note that giant water bugs are strong predators in aquatic ecosystems. They are known for their powerful bite, which they use to immobilize and feed on prey like insects, small fish, tadpoles, and even small aquatic animals. 
Up next we have giant weta. Giant weta refers to a group of large, flightless insects found in New Zealand. They are among the heaviest and most massive insects in the world. Giant weta come in various species, but they generally have a robust and bulky body with powerful legs. They resemble crickets and grasshoppers but are much larger. Their bodies are covered in spiky, bristle-like hairs. Their coloration can vary from brown to green, allowing them to blend into their natural habitat. Giant weta have long, slender antennae that they use to sense their environment and communicate with other insects. Their legs are strong and adapted for gripping surfaces, as well as for jumping and climbing. The length of giant weta varies based on the species. Generally, giant weta are larger and heavier than common insects. They can have body lengths ranging from 2 to 4 inches, 5 to 10 centimeters, not including their legs and antennae. Their large size makes them particularly intriguing to entomologists and those interested in unique insect species. It's important to note that different species of giant weta have slightly different physical characteristics and habits. Some are more arboreal, tree-dwelling, while others are ground-dwelling. Coming up next we have Goliath beetle. Goliath beetles are some of the largest and most impressive beetles in the insect world. Goliath beetles belong to the genus Goliathus and are known for their massive size and striking appearance. They have a robust and compact body, with a unique and intricate exoskeleton. Their exoskeleton can vary in color, ranging from shades of black, brown, green, or even metallic hues, depending on the species and subspecies. The length of Goliath beetles can vary depending on the species, sex, and subspecies. However, on average, adult Goliath beetles are around 2 to 4 inches 5 to 10 centimeters, in length. Males are usually slightly smaller than females. It's important to note that the size of Goliath beetles can vary greatly based on their life stage. Their larval stage is quite large compared to other beetle species, and they undergo several instars growth stages before pupating and emerging as adults. Male goliath beetles often have thoracic horns, which are elongated projections on their thorax. These horns can vary in size and shape among different species and are used in battles between males for mating rights. The elytra, the hardened forewings of goliath beetles, are often adorned with raised patterns and structures that add to their visual appeal. The elytra protect the delicate flight wings underneath. Goliath beetles are highly sought after by insect enthusiasts and collectors due to their impressive size and stunning appearance. We are halfway through today's video but I realize many of you watching haven't liked or subscribed to the channel, we would greatly appreciate it if you could hit that subscribe button and leave a like or comment, your support goes a long way in helping us grow. Taking 5th place we have Giant Long-Legged Katydid. The giant long-legged katydid, Macrolyrus corporalis, is a fascinating insect known for its remarkable size and distinctive appearance. As the name suggests, the giant long-legged katydid is characterized by its elongated and slender body. It is one of the largest katydid species in the world. The body is typically a mix of green and brown colors, which helps it blend into its environment. The length of the giant long-legged katydid can vary depending on the individual and environmental factors. On average, these katydids can grow to be around 4 to 6 inches 10 to 15 centimeters in length, with their long legs accounting for a significant portion of their overall size. It's worth noting that size variations can occur due to factors such as geographic location, habitat, and availability of food. Despite their large size, these katydids are well adapted to their environment and play a role in the ecosystems they inhabit. The most striking feature of this katydid is its incredibly long legs, which are adapted for grasping onto vegetation and moving around in its habitat. The legs are usually a pale color, contributing to its overall appearance. Like other katydids, the giant long-legged katydid has long and thin antennae that it uses to detect its surroundings and communicate with other individuals. This katydid has fully developed wings, which are typically brown with green patterns. However, its primary mode of movement is through its legs, and it is not known for its flying abilities. Taking fourth place we have Hercules beetle. The Hercules beetle, Dynasts Hercules, is one of the largest and most impressive beetles in the world. The Hercules beetle is known for its massive size and robust build. It has a thick, elongated body with a characteristic horn on its head, which varies in size and shape based on the specific subspecies and whether it's a male or female. Males typically have larger horns used for combat and display during mating. 
The length of Hercules beetles can vary based on species, sex, and the specific subspecies. In general, the Hercules beetle can reach lengths of about 2.5 to 7 inches, 6.3 to 17.8 centimeters, including its horn. The horns of some male Hercules beetles can measure up to half of their total body length, contributing to their impressive appearance. The coloration of Hercules beetles can vary. They often have a mix of black, brown, and sometimes green hues. Their elytra hardened forewings may have distinct patterns, textures, and reflective qualities. The males of many Hercules beetle species have prominent horns on their head and pronotum, the top part of the thorax. These horns are used for competing with other males for mates and resources, as well as for establishing dominance. Hercules beetles have strong legs equipped with sharp claws that help them grip onto surfaces, including leaves and branches. Their antennae are clubbed and used for sensing their environment and interacting with other beetles. It's important to note that the size of the Hercules beetle can vary greatly between different subspecies and individuals. Kicking off the top three we have Titan beetle. The Titan beetle, Titanus gigantus, is one of the largest beetles in the world, known for its impressive size and unique appearance. The Titan beetle is renowned for its extraordinary size. It can reach lengths of up to 6.5 to 7 inches, 16.5 to 17.6 centimeters, and can have a wingspan of around 8 inches, 20.3 centimeters. This remarkable size makes it one of the largest beetles on the planet. The Titan beetle has a dark and glossy exoskeleton, typically black or dark brown in color. Its body is elongated and cylindrical, with distinct segments. The beetle's body is robust and well-built. It has a prominent head with large mandibles that it uses for feeding and defense. The thorax and abdomen are segmented, and the abdomen ends in a pair of wings covered by protective wing covers, or elytra. The titan beetle has long antennae that are used for sensory perception and detecting its environment. The titan beetle is found in the rainforests of South America, particularly in countries like Brazil, Colombia, and Venezuela. It prefers habitats with decaying wood, where its larvae can feed and develop. Despite its impressive size, the titan beetle is not well studied, and not much is known about its behavior, life cycle, or ecological role in its habitat. Its elusive nature and remote rainforest habitat have contributed to the limited information available about this magnificent insect. Taking second place we have Atlas Moth. The Atlas Moth, Atticus Atlas, is one of the largest moth species in the world, known for its impressive size and beautiful wing patterns, the Atlas moth is renowned for its large size. In terms of wingspan, it can range from approximately 8 to 12 inches, 20 to 30 centimeters, or even more, making it one of the largest moths in terms of surface area. The wings of the Atlas moth have intricate patterns that resemble the patterns found on maps, giving the species its name. The wings are usually a combination of reddish-brown, yellow, and orange hues, with subtle lines and spots that help with camouflage, the wings of the Atlas moth are relatively thin, yet their large size makes them appear substantial. The wings are held in a characteristic V-shape when the moth is at rest. The body of the Atlas moth is robust and hairy, with a dark brown or reddish-brown color. Its body tapers from the thorax to the abdomen, where it ends in a pointed tip. Atlas moths are notable not only for their impressive size but also for their short adult lifespan. They are short-lived as adults, usually surviving for only a few days to a week. During this time, their primary focus is mating and reproduction. Taking first place on today's list we have giant walking stick insects. Giant walking sticks, also known as stick insects or phasmids, are fascinating insects that are known for their remarkable camouflage and resemblance to twigs or sticks. Giant walking sticks have an elongated and slender body, resembling the shape of sticks or twigs. This unique body shape helps them blend seamlessly into their natural habitat. Their coloration can vary depending on their specific environment, but they often have earthy tones such as brown, green, or gray. Their bodies are often marked with patterns that mimic the texture of bark or leaves, enhancing their camouflage. They have six jointed legs that are relatively long and thin, further contributing to their stick-like appearance. These legs allow them to navigate their environment with a slow and deliberate walking motion. Giant walking sticks have long and thin antennae that help them detect their surroundings, find food, and sense changes in their environment. Some species of giant walking sticks have small, underdeveloped wings, while others are completely wingless. These wings, 
even if non-functional, contribute to their overall appearance. The length of giant walking sticks can vary depending on the species and gender. On average, they range from around 4 to 8 inches 10 to 20 centimeters in length. However, some species can reach lengths of up to 12 inches 30 centimeters or even longer. Females are usually larger than males. Female giant walking sticks often have a more robust body and are equipped with an ovipositor, a specialized structure for laying eggs. Giant walking sticks are well known for their incredible mimicry and adaptation to their environment. Their stick-like appearance helps them avoid predators by blending in with twigs and foliage. They are fascinating insects to observe due to their unique camouflage, slow movement, and intriguing behaviors. We have come to the end of today's video but before you go, I just want to thank you for watching, I appreciate it and please feel free to leave a like, comment and subscribe. Also check out my Instagram link in the bio, for more photos and video clips. This is Animals Facts, see you next time with more facts.